Hello everybody and welcome back to Cattails where at the moment I am just doing a little bit of um, den rearranging because someone in the comments said that if I just oops just pop everything on the ground it'll just kind of stack oh, oh I'm doing a really bad job of this hold drop hold drop inventory hold drop Oh yeah, it just sort of stacks on top of... If you just stand in the same place and just keep dropping it, it'll just sort of stack on in the same place and then it's not as untidy. There's a bit of an untidy den in here, I suppose. And then I can just take a little bit out of the stack each time I need something. I'll probably snack on these little animals that are scattered all over the place. Uh, so maybe I'll, I'll make just different piles of all the herbs like the licorice roots and stuff and the lavender and the valerian and all that oh, I've picked up quite a lot of stuff actually so down here I think my tortoise I think he's going to be called Fred so hold that drop it oh no I picked up the golden ah they need to be far enough away from each other I guess The valerian will just pop on the floor there. I'll just keep holding, popping. Ah, stop it. Hold, drop. Hold, drop. Yeah, I know I suck. Hold, drop. Hold. Drop. Hold. Drop. So we can make little piles of things basically on the floor. Just get those uh, in our inventory. So I'll make a little lavender one. A little licorice root one. Loads of room for stuff in my den then. So I can get a lot of meows for, or mews or whatever you want to call them. For that catnip apparently. So let's go sell the catnip. I picked them back up again. Suck, I suck, I suck. Hold. It's just getting used to the controls. Row, hold that. I'm going to go across to the other side to make a little pile of stuff in here. This is my winter stock, you see. And the next piece of awesome, awesome advice I have been given by my subscribers is that the mountain region is the best. Uh, hold. The mountain region is the best. I'll keep those and I'll keep the catnip. I need. Ah! I'm starving. It took me that long to sort my stuff out. Okay, I'm going to go sell the catnip. That was the first three minutes of my let's play with sorting out inventory. But, you know, three minutes considering we're on like the fifth episode, you can cope with that, surely. So, let's have a chat. Visit the shop, sell items. I would like to sell that catnip for 15. Well, that's actually quite a lot. Oh. Apparently 15 is a lot. So can I buy anything good? Buy items. Golden seal, marigold, mouse. Inventory expansion, 150 mews. Some different colours, they'll cost a bit more. Some stuff to wear, which will cost a little bit more as well. I don't know if we get... It's just a fun accessory for a cat to wear. So it's not like you get 
cold in the winter or anything too bad like that. Now, people have said to me that the mountain area... I want to view the map. So the mountainous areas... So this is mountain up here. Are the ones where we're going to find more black hairs. So... I want to be in the sort of mountainy areas, but I need to try and keep away as much as I can from the uh, the mountain cats. So possibly around here, maybe, and then the mountain mystic area around here. Not really sure, but we'll have it. We'll try and keep around the mountainy areas. To the north and see if we can find a black hair again today because uh, we really need that to progress the storyline we need to go north and let's have a look at my exps i can get better swimming or better foraging not sure Got good hunting skills nowadays. This is the old abandoned cottage. We have some golden seal. And I can see a little squirrel nutkins over there. I'm hoping that having uh, the tortoise with us doesn't stop us from hunting. It doesn't seem to, so that's good. We're going to need loads of stuff to eat come the winter, apparently. So we really need to be stockpiling. I don't know how much we're going to find in the winter and how much less there will be. But apparently it's going to be lean times, so... Something to, to eat there. Keeping an eye out for any animals. I may need to put some more points into foraging. The rabbit. Oh, close. Marigold there. See if the rabbit is still around or whether he's completely disappeared. Did someone say that they kept seeing arrows? Now, I haven't seen any arrows, but that could just be me being uh oh still not close enough. Oh, we get arrows when we accidentally sprint, which is something I do quite often. But I'm silly like that. No. I think we already foraged that one. The rabbit has gone. Oh, loads of blackberry bushes. La la la, I'm not in your mountain territory. Totes not in your mountain territory. Okay, so to get across the river, I really kind of need to... What is that? Oh, it's just leaves are blowing everywhere. Okay. I do need better swimming. I can only just make it across this river. And I do take damage points. I'd love to get to that island. Which can only be got to by swimming, seemingly. Frog. Let's see if we can get him. Sometimes I just don't go too I go too far, sometimes I don't go far enough. It's extremely frustrating. So we're on the right side of the river now. 
It's no good finding black hairs if I can't even catch them though, is it? It's not like it's my hunting skill. Oh, he's going to go in the water. Stupid frog. I don't do very well at this, am I? So that's the licorice root tree. I've caught one squirrel so far today, so that's good. It's like a tasty snack. I get the impression I'm going to be living off blackberries for the whole of winter. Maybe I could go in the cave and hunt bats. Mm -hmm. Where are we now? The central field. Now this is enemy territory. Well, be careful. Nicking all their stuff. A mouse over there. That would be useful. A bit of dinner. Got him! Okay, I think we do need to eat some of our ill-gotten gains. I wonder whether you, you're more successful at hunting if you're not hungry. Might be. It'd be interesting to know that, actually. So I need to be careful with where I'm going. Go this way. Loads of lavender. Let's try and keep away from all the enemy cats. Generally, I just got, I can just run away from them, and I haven't even had to really use sprint to get away from them yet either. We'll look, there's some more valerian root. Good for keeping calm. Keep going. Island corner, so this is a complete, like, enemy territory land. coming towards me. I don't want to be behind it to be honest. Oh annoying. It's been a straight line from it. I would have got stuck on the tree there anyway. Rabbits are so annoying. I never catch them. I'm not here. I'm like, Totes not here. Totes not here. Turn around. Got him. Ha ha ha. Nice. Need to do that for a black hair now, that's all. Right. My infantry looking a bit full, but never mind. Definitely a lot more rabbits around this area. For us to stalk. Possibly eat. I overdid that one. I'm gonna eat one of the rabbits actually. Windy and rainy. 
rainy, isn't it? It's horrible. Southeast Highlands. So we're now in like mystic territory. Interesting. We've been out all night. But that's okay. The East Highlands. This has actually got a little bit of forest cat influence. So someone's been up here. Influencing. This is like a, a big old mountain. With rabbits. I'll just be able to swipe it, honestly. Okay. Oh, I sprinted again. I'm not here. I'm not here. Look away. Ah! I was trying so hard to tell it that I wasn't there. Okay, so we're in the heart of this big rocky land now. It. The problem with rabbits is that even if they come within. Why am I sprinting again? That's gone off into the trees, that's annoying. My inventory is full? Oh no! Maybe we should eat something. I'll eat some more berries. Nah, I'll get some more off the, off the tree. I may as well. Seems as they're there anymore. So we're at the top of the map here. Still not found any black hairs. I'm at the point now where I would buy one. I would buy one right now. Like, seriously, I would. Take all this stuff out. Again, I need to. Sounded a bit like Yoda then, didn't I? Take the stuff out of my den, I need to. Yeah, here's another rabbit. Got it. Um, we're hungry. Eat a squirrel. So much stuff I could pick up, Anna. Oh no. Oh, blackberries and stuff up there as well. Eek! Staying out of the way of the other cats right now. All I want is to do some hunting. So we find a black bear. We'll maybe go and speak to Mayor about it. Maybe he has some, some wisdom about this. Oh look, there's a nice bridge. Where on earth are we? Okay. Oh. Get out of here without swimming? I've got no idea. Probably can. River corner. Oh, I hate having to walk past all this stuff. Oh, 
Okay, I think we might be near the mole cave now. If that's the case, we're nearly at a bridge across the river. He's running away. Sprint on after. Why? Why when he runs away through the cut uh, to the edge of the map? Can I not follow him off the edge of the map? That sucks. Utterly sucks. Rainy. Whoa. Do I see something over there? I might not have, just in case I did. sucks but that's that's just the way of it I guess what are we like for exp 77 so actually we can hunt even more effectively at this point yep but I'm not seeing any of these um, sort of hunting upgrades anymore like you're supposed to have all sorts of upgrades to the hunting I'm going to go through a contested area now. Or go miles out of my way to get home. I just want to get back to my den and drop a few things off. I could help. Oh no! All my forest dudes have gone! <gasps> that sucks. We need to get better at fighting so we can help with that a bit more. I can't take on three of them on my own, maybe one. Yeah, I am not happy. I'm not happy that the rabbit runs away off the edge of the map and then it's allowed to just run away. That should not be allowed, quite frankly. Maybe I'll have a sleep on my dad as well. I can get into my den. Den, where are you? Okay, so I'll pop a few things away out of my very overstocked inventory. Or I could sell, I could probably sell a ton of this stuff. Like lavender. Gain power for your colony in an area. I should maybe be using that a bit more, but maybe we'll go and sell some stuff to Ember. See if we can get a bigger inventory. Hi, Maya. Greetings. Stay, stay sharp out there and don't wander too far from the borders. Do you travel a lot? If so, you've surely seen the rumbling stones to the south. They were laid by humans before our kindred came to this forest. The rumbling stones. Is that. The, do you mean the road? I think they might mean the road. Hey, Ember. Let's talk. You know, the average cat needs about three mice worth of food a day to survive. And luckily for you, I've got the best mice in the business with cheap prices. So are you hungry at all? Not really. I can hunt really well. So I would like to sell items. I want to get to like 150. So, four, eight, twelve... The rabbit cell for four, three, 
four, 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 four. I'll keep a couple of them. Oh, and marigolds. One more catnip, 54. That should be enough. Yep. And then, I want to buy selling Valyria for 30 mews. That's ridiculous. An inventory expansion! An extra six slots in my inventory. Thank you. Now I've got my inventory, I've got another six slots there, which is going to be incredibly handy. So let's go to my cave and pop away some of the more foodie sort of items I've got. But I need to eat some of them, unfortunately. Eat the rabbit. Put some blackberries down in the blackberry pile. Really kind of wish that I could do this for multiples. <laughs> this is kind of annoying. a way to do this for multiples at once I've not been able to find it but if you know of a way and I'm just being silly and not understanding it or something then please let me know I've got lots of different oh, I'm picking them all up again hold put down hold put down hold put down Valyrian, hold. Down. Hold. Down. Lavender, hold you. Put you down here. So I just got little piles of herbs and stuff over here now. Okay, so let's have a little sleep. I probably don't really need to sleep unless I've taken damage. Oh no, sleeping doesn't improve my damage. Okay. Oh no, it does. So if I've taken a lot of damage and it's more than I can heal with all my roots and stuff, then that's when I need to come back to my den and have a good sleep. But generally, I'll probably be okay. Hopefully soon I should have enough to start giving out presents. Maybe next spring. Did you need, need something? I don't think I know you. How about we change that right now? Name Scout. I work for Mayor. Our colony relies on my skills to make sure our borders are safe and all. It isn't a glamorous job, but hey, someone's got to do it. I'm sure I did know you. Okay, I'd like to say that I'm the best in the business when it comes to sneaking around, but I can't be sure that I'm right. After all, what if there's a sneakier cat? And I just don't know about them because they're too sneaky. That's so true. Maybe I'm sneakier. Hey Sarge. Good day to you. I don't like to see cats from other colonies around here. This is our territory. Cats are very territorial. Hey there, how are you doing today? I never need healing. I'm always happy to talk for a spell with anyone who's got the ear for it. Fair warning though, folks have told me the old dog can be a little long-winded, if you know what I mean. There's never been such a thing as a stranger to me, and that's a promise you can count on. Feel free to stop by and chat at any time. Try to have a chat with everyone. Ember's not there. Where's Ember gone? Mia, where did Ember go? Stay sharp out there, don't wander too far from the borders. The forest colony is an established government here, but that was not always the case. Many years ago, as my mother told me, our people came from the far west as to settle here. According to the rumours, the original settlers who founded our home liked this place much better than their previous dwelling in nearly every way. I can understand why people maybe think you're intruders then. We're gonna 
hang on out towards the mountain areas again. See what we can get. The fairy wood. So that this is getting a bit more mystical, isn't it? I can't believe how much I'm sucking at hunting right now, considering how good I'm supposed to be at hunting. That's a nice snack then. So that will keep us up to 100%. Forest eaves. Let's see what we can find. Nice little squirrel up there, maybe. If we stalk it nice and careful. It's supposed to be giving us at some point a ring. To, well, unless that's an active skill thing. We're supposed to be giving. Study prey. Uh, that's what I need. How much EXP do I have? 13. Right. So we're going to have study prey soon. I'm going to make sure we get that next. We're going to save up 100 EXP, which is going to take ages. But I'll avoid that happening. I won't get too close then. forest. Maybe we should have done, gotten that active skill first. I need to go back to my den to gain it, but I need to be out here to pick things up. Get like two, four, six EXP, for example, there. Which is fantastic. I wonder how much EXP I get, like, in the mines. Always, worth, always a question worth asking. This river then, all the way down, all the way back up. Or I swim. <gasps> the rabbit! Oh my goodness. It fell down there. Oh, that sucks. I so need that study prey skill. We're going to work towards it. I think this is the way across. One there. Let's see. Let's stalk it. There's an arrow there. I would to say to me, there's prey over the river. But I know that there's black rabbits around here. Black hares. that pointing me towards prey? Maybe towards that mouse. A bit faster and then we'll sneak up on him. sneaky but he's, the problem was he was getting so close to the edge of the map I was starting to panic that he was just going to wander off oh dear oh there's another one they're blimmin' everywhere sneak and try and follow him going down the river there right, wait for King to go Oh no! Oh no! Duke's here! Duke's not from Mars either! Oh no! Get off me, Duke! I don't know if I'm gonna die here. Quick, sprint! Sprint away! Run away! Sprint! Oh well, that was annoying, because 
there were rabbits there, but there were too many enemies. It sucks. I'm hungry. I have to eat my blackberries now. Maybe need to take swimming. Just a little bit. go see Doc, I think. I wonder if he charges for healing or, or what. I haven't tried healing at his yet. I can't believe I still failed to hunt a blooming... Oh, I'm failing to hunt mice at this point. I'm a failure of a cat. Oh, go away. Oh. south. Turn the south again. So much prey that I could be getting. I need healing so much more. Okay. Let's go see Doc. See if he charges for healings. Ember's back! Yay! Hey there, how are you doing today? I need healing. Well, let's see about that. I'll treat you for fully 21 mews, or I can give you a small dose for 8 mews. I don't have enough mews. Oh no! How about I sleep instead then? I'll just go to sleep. She loves them! Go to sleep and save the game probably how much health I regen overnight. About half of it, okay. I'm going to use some Valyrian. Get 10% movement speed, that's awesome. I'm a bit hungry, so I'm going to pick up this bird, I think. Well, I've got a couple of birds. keep using that Valyrian root stuff. Oh, hi! Hey, Sheila, but I thought I would stop by and see how everything is going. Are you enjoying your new home out here in the wilderness? Yes, I am, Coco. It's going to be a hard life at first, but you'll get used to it if you aren't already. I'm sure you've made plenty of new friends, right? Or maybe even someone you'd consider more than a friend. No need to get all embarrassed. I figured you'd find someone special pretty quickly. Am I right? Listen, I have something very important to show you. It might even help you out. Come with me, Sheila. Welcome to the sacred temple. This is where I wanted to bring you. You see this rose bush? It will always bloom right here in the middle of the wilderness at the sacred temple. It's a special plant, one of a kind. Cats of all colonies revere it. Since you're not from around here, I don't expect you to know the customs of the wild cats. I'll explain. The flowers that this bush produce are considered by many to be the physical embodiment of pure love. If a cat is romantically interested in another cat, they come here to the temple and pick a red rose from the bush. Then they take the red rose to the one they love. And the recipient cat has to decide if they're also interested in the giver of the rose. If they are, then the two start dating. That's so cute. It's a very serious thing to give a red rose to another cat. Make sure you know what you're doing if you plan on using one. I've also heard of a rare black rose that can be given to end your relationship with another cat. But hopefully you'll never need to use one of those. This bush will produce one new red rose each day. Remember, if you're interested in another cat, Come here to the temple and gather a red rose. And give it to the cat your heart most desires. If you're lucky, they'll feel the same way. And the two of you will start dating. That's all I had to show you. You should return to your colony now. I'm sure I'll be seeing you around soon, she lap. Did you teleport me all the way here? 
And now you're not going to tell... Oh, you, oh, okay. Te oh, yeah, yeah. You teleported me back. That's fine. Okay, so I'm not very well healed yet. I'll probably need to come back and have another sleep at the end of the day because I got really hurt. So I'm just going to go hunting around that river region again. Oh, here we are, some more golden seal. I might, I might eat any golden seal I find, honestly. Blackberries. More blackberries in here. There's all these things I didn't manage to pick up the other day. And there's a few little mice around that we could hunt around here. Which would be a little bit easier. Oh yeah, mice let you get close, but yeah. Meow. That's better. I have to make the sound. Doesn't count otherwise. Oh yeah, I am getting arrows for prey now, and it's showing me kind of what kind of prey it is as well. I'm not here. Yeah, it started running. It's not running as far either. At least I don't think so. Ah, oh, darn it. That was my fault. I just went a little bit too fast. Oh, he's still there. Got him. Yay. These hunting levels are really helping, but I definitely think the, the prey thing is going to help so much more. 18 EXP, so we'll just go and, and grind some more EXP. But I think we're going to have to do that next episode. So I'm going to carry on um, from this point and I'll just keep going into the next episode. So we're not going to sleep or save or anything. We're just going to carry straight on. But I'm going to leave you there for today because we're going for another 45 minutes trying to find this hair. I hope other people have as much trouble as I'm having. Because honestly, it's horrendous. Maybe, maybe it's to try and get your hunting skills up that you've got to try and find this black hair. Uh, that's what I think anyway. But anyway, if you like the video, do please leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more cattails, then please subscribe and I will let you know when those videos are going out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.